Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. I thought I'd make a video on how I went vegan and how you can too, or even plant-based, uh, however you want to say it. So essentially, uh, for those of you who don't know, uh, vegan is an ethical um, stance uh, against eating animals, against using animal products, or even eating animal secretions. Basically anything to do with animals, whether it's eating the animal, or uh, using any of their products, whether it be their wool or their milk. Um, obviously, plant-based diet is just simply not eating animals. Uh, personally, I'm a vegan, but um, initially I started out on a plant-based lifestyle. Um, and that's obviously how I eventually transitioned to a vegan. Um, so what I'll tell you is how I transitioned. Um, initially, I started eating a lot, and I mean a lot, of carbs. Um, I started adding, uh, well initially I didn't because I was scared of beans for some reason and um, a lot of the people that I uh, watched the videos at the time said that oh you shouldn't eat beans blah 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 but anyway to, to cut a long story short eventually and now uh, I eat beans so I'd essentially um, at every meal that I used to eat compromised the three things so it compromised the meat, the carb, so whether it's potato or chips or, or whatever and then the vegetables, uh, by chips I mean fries for those American viewers, uh, and then the vegetables. So now I have the beans. So basically the meal still compromises of the three things, the protein, the carbs, and the nutrients, i.e. the vegetables. Um, so I would have, for example now, I would have kidney beans with potatoes, with vegetables so those vegetables can be greens leafy greens broccoli um, carrots any anything like that cauliflower etc so kind of like a mixed vegetable batch I'll have with it and then I'll have some kind of either potato or rice or pasta I always try and go for whole grain though as possible so brown rice whole grain pasta and then of course I will eat the beans now for those of you who are out there who might not necessarily be health conscious you might want to just simply um, replace the, the things that you're eating now so maybe you're eating your bacon now uh, and you want to go vegan so maybe you have veggie bacon um, and then if, if you maybe have uh, in England we have a kind of meal called a Sunday dinner where we have uh, on, usually on a Sunday we have the kind of meat the potatoes the vegetables the stuffing balls the gravy um, so obviously instead of having like a chicken gravy you can obviously have a vegetable gravy. Instead of having meat, you can have beans, or you can maybe have tofu, or some kind of um, mock meat, or something like that, maybe seitan, or something. Uh, obviously, you can still have your potatoes, you can still have your stuffing bowls, and like I said, obviously the gravy, instead of a chicken gravy, you've got a vegetable gravy. So, you can either essentially just swap like for like. However, this way can be very expensive. Um, now, personally, beans, grains, uh, and stuff like that are, are the cheapest foods on the planet so I will eat beans instead of the meat now and how I can even make the beans into a, some sort of pate or I can make them into a burger or, or something like that if, if I if I would want to so essentially you can just swap like for like so I'm not saying you have to, to worry uh, about getting your protein because you can still worry you can still get it through just simply eating carbs so you can basically just have a giant um, plate will not giant but however however big you need plate of potatoes and vegetables and you're good to go so um, for those of you who, who need to know about transitioning um, just just like I said you can either just swap like for like in your transition period or swap uh, meat for beans or something like that so um, as, as for um, count, counting calories or something like that I would say initially just eat until you're full until you're satisfied if it is refined possibly consider uh, checking amounts things like that so essentially that's how I transitioned uh, it was a very very easy transition maybe two months later um, it was like I'd, I'd done it all my life so those are my uh, tips on how I transitioned to being vegan and how you can too Hope you enjoyed the video. See you in the next video, everyone.